What is up guys? Welcome back to the Brave Angler. So today we have some new toys to play with while we are in the lab. That being a giant jerkbait mold. These are eight inch jerkbaits. I've been uh, fishing with a lot of these lately and I told you guys we would be getting one of these. And here it is. It is a colossal mold. This one does three at one time. It's from Angling AI. And like I said, I am super excited because I've been wanting one of these for a long time. You know, uh, jerk baits have a near and dear place in my heart as being one of the lures that we can use year round here in Florida. And it was our first mold was the five inch jerk bait from Angling AI. So it only makes sense that we get their big boy too. All right. And then as well, we also got some new colorants and glitters in. We got watermelon from Lower Works, June bug, and red bug. These two have been playing a pretty big part in our fishing here in the fall and winter. So it only makes sense that uh, we go ahead and get actual colorants. All right, so today we are gonna be making some June bug giant jerk baits. And we're gonna do it a little differently. We're also, uh, most people just add in the green glitter. We are also gonna be adding some purple glitter as well. Uh, just to give it a little texture. All right, so let's go ahead and get the plastic prep and we'll mix up our June bug color and we'll be right back with you guys. So we got one cup of Plastisol, swim, our swim bait and jerk bait blend. All right, what we're gonna do, we're gonna do 35 drops of the June bug colorant I think that will get us right in the ballpark we need to be in. See what we got going on with that. Yeah, that looks, actually that looks perfect. Now what we're gonna do, is we are gonna do a quarter teaspoon of the purple flake for texture. And then we are gonna do a quarter teaspoon of the green, yeah, let's do two. All right, let's see what that gets us there. Yep, that looks really good. Try and get some of this glitter off the top. Show you what we're working with. All right. So as you guys can see, that looks. Pretty darn good, I would say. I think we might need a little bit more of the green, just a, maybe a half. Yeah. All right, I think that's gonna be where we need to be at. That's it right there, guys. Now, Caroline wants to call this color Perpetrator. We're gonna throw that back in, 30 more seconds, heat it back up so we can run it through our vacuum chamber. But yeah, so Caroline wants the June bug color to be called Perpetrator. So that's why we're putting the purple in there just to put that emphasis on there. And like I said, for a little bit of texture. I think these are gonna come out amazing and we're gonna be doing them in the jerkbait mold as well as a crawl and of course the 10 inch ribbon worm. So. Like I said, guys, I'm super excited, but we're gonna get the moisture out of this plastic and get ready to shoot. All right, we're gonna see where we're at temperature wise. I like to do like injection molds about 320. I think that's like where I get the best results. A lot of people will say around 345, you know, that kind of stuff, but it is kind of cold out today, so. We're really uh, going to be fighting with temperatures. You know, we're out here in our bait trailer. We call it the lab. All right, we're sitting at about 318. So we'll go ahead and uh, shoot that right quick. Stir it up one more time just so that glitter is nice and even spread throughout. All right. Uh, 
Now this mold does take quite a bit of plastic. Pretty much took that entire syringe. All right, this one should be good. See how these turned out. All right, look at that guys. Beautiful. Oh yeah, guys. Look at that butte. That is a jerk bait, my friends. Go ahead and uh, we'll blanch them. Mm, man, that is a big jerk bait. A lot of plastic, a lot of plastic. See how the bank heist came out in the colossal felony flyer. My gosh, it is so crazy how huge these things are. I mean, look at that, guys. Like, my lord. That is just a massive, massive bait. Ton of plastic. I mean, it, the plastic itself, it uses about three quarters of a cup just for one run of it. That is absolutely insane, but I cannot wait to try one. Like, can you imagine the monsters you catch on those? Like, my, woo! All right, guys, so obviously we love our new toy. These came out absolutely amazing. Uh, this is definitely a June bug color that, you know, that we're gonna call perpetrator that I can be proud of. And I think Caroline absolutely loves it. Yes, I love it. But these things are absolutely massive. I am so excited to try one. To give you some guys a comparison, this right here is a Zoom Magnum Fluke. It's a seven inch fluke, right? So as you can see, it's pretty big itself. But when you compare it <laughs> to the new felony flyer. That's like it's like it has a whole personality. That's yeah. how big it is. <laughs> like look how look how different the thicknesses are, guys. That and on top of that, you know, you're talking another extra inch. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. So, like I said, we are so excited to try these. Here you go. And, uh, you know, just to start run, we had some leftover, uh, we had some leftover bank heist. So we went ahead and uh, did them in the bank heist as well. This was actually catching us a lot of, uh, a lot of fish when we were practicing for our tournament. But as you guys saw on our tournament day, <laughs> flukes did nothing for us. So, but if you guys like content like this, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. We are gonna be adding the eight inch felony flyer to our website. So those will be available for you guys to purchase by the time this video goes out. Thank you so much for coming and checking out our video today. Now go catch a fish.